All right, for a new Tesla owner, you no longer have ultrasonic sensor, so you won't see these anymore. You will rely on these images that is not accurate because there is no bus in front of me. Definitely no bus in front of me. It's definitely not a bus, but it's wiggling. How can you tell? I mean, this has Tesla vision functional, but how can you tell how close you are? I mean, it's ridiculous, right? So if I didn't have the ultrasonic sensor, I wouldn't have these this distant measurement. Although the new the new Tesla Vision, supposedly those measurements are are now more accurate if you do have that latest firmware update, most dealt. Um, what I do rely on in addition to this ultrasonic is also this 10.25 inch display from Handshow. So as you can see there, there's a front camera. Now I see how close I am. In addition to the verbal warning, but the verbal warning stop when, when this touches the stop. So it doesn't beep all the time. So I do rely on this camera. And this one automatically turn on when the ultrasonic is beeping. So, or at low speed, you can set it to either. Or you can manually turn it on to have it on 24 seven. So highly recommend this screen with the front camera. It is high resolution, high definition. It's, it's definitely not 4K, but you can read license plate, assuming that there's no reflective license plate. If you have your headlights on, it doesn't read well, but daytime it reads it perfectly. And you also have the ability to check tire pressure or, or let me go back here. You can check tire pressure. You can turn on your navigation. Let's see, tire pressure is there. Although Tesla did bring this back to the main display on the bottom left, but it's not as a default. You can go to different app, CarPlay. You can actually go CarPlay, Android Auto, play your music, application, check out all the application on here. So this has all the Android application. How cool is that? You can also watch video live while you're driving on this display. So like YouTube or any other app you download, HBO Max, YouTube, you just need a connection. So either Tether, Wi-Fi or Hotspot. Check out link in description.